Hi, in this tutorial I will demonstrate the steps needed uh, to connect or access your Windows Server 2019 EC2 instance uh, using uh, remote desktop connection. So once you've signed into your AWS uh, console, uh, you, you can uh, search uh, EC2 and click on EC2. Uh, go from the left side to instance. And here you see um, my Windows Server 2019 EC2 running. Uh, so make sure to choose this uh, instance. And also now before we connect, um, we have to make sure that uh, the security group is uh, set up uh, correctly. So from, from down there, you have security group on the right side. Uh, click on your security group and make sure that your inbound rules uh, allow the RDP. So this is remote desktop uh, protocol. It's a Microsoft protocol to allow users to remotely access the graphical interface for their um, server or Windows host. Uh, so we are allowing everything and this is the protocol uh, port number so a3389 so go back to instance and here we can start connect so here it says your pop we are going to connect using our public ip or you also can use your dns um, public uh, so here you have our default username for uh, the server its administrator and this part you're gonna click on get password to access or log into your Windows Server 2019 so click on get password um, as you remember when you created your EC2 you also generated a key pair uh, so here it ask it asks us for the .bin file this is my private uh, key pair that I generated when I created this uh, server. Uh, so choose file and select uh, the BIM file. So here is the, uh, the uh, private key and click on decrypt password. Uh, now that I have uh, the password, I will just copy that password, uh, download uh, the um, uh, remote desktop application and once it's done click on the application file and it should show you this click on connect uh, paste your password here as an admin click on ok and click yes now that it's successfully connected uh, i'm inside my windows server 2019 ec2 instance um and, and that's it um if you have a problems connected uh, make sure your security group is uh, configured correctly and also make sure uh, you have a public ipv4 and also make sure that your uh, virtual private cloud does has a gateway and the gateway is attached to your private cloud to access to the internet uh, make sure to set up all this in the VPC and that should be it for this tutorial. I hope you enjoy it and thank you for watching. Bye